energy both inside and outside the arena tonight as we are just moments away now from puck drop. The Oilers take possession here on the opening draw and we are underway. Shot! Denies him! He got all of it! Picked up along the boards by Curry. Handles the pass. From the right side, they gain the zone. Edmonton grabbed a hold of the puck. Oh, he laid a solid hit on him there. He was waiting for him and laid the shoulder right into him. That might loosen a few of the choppers on that play. He wants everybody to know this is going to be a physical game. Pasternak's got the puck along the wing. Quick shot. And he had the answer on that one. Moves it quickly over to Gretzky. And he takes the pass. to Kane, and he makes the save. The Bruins take the puck through the neutral zone. Here's a short pass to Pasternak. Wow! He scores! Big goal from David Pasternak! Boston's look like the more aggressive team, and for good reason now with the lead. Now they've got that lead, they can play with the pace that they want to. They can really control how this game is played. Moves the puck. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Bergeron. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. The Bruins take possession in the neutral zone. And that pass doesn't go. Moves it to Dreisaitl. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. And the puck's kicked free. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Middleton's gained the line and on the attack. Oh, had a chance to make a nice move and the puck disagreed with him. Middleton's trying a little bit too much there. They're in the offensive zone. Just make a direct, simple, quick play. Probably better off than trying to do what he did there. Edmonton's looking to break out of their own end. Gaining speed through center and here they come on the attack. Here's a shot. Oh, and he makes the save. I thought he was beaten on that one-timer, but no. And he was ready for that one. Moves on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. Nearing the midway mark of the period. 1-0 the score. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Boston's got control of it now from their own end. Moves it around along the half wall. Let's it go. Denies him on the play. Great heads up play to poke it away at the offensive end. Take it along the wall by Neely. O'Reilly's got the puck near the back end. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Great save on the play as he kicks the toe out. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. Quick feed to Hyman. Oh! Really good play to score. And to get this game back to even, now we'll see who can grab momentum. Well past the midway mark of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Boston's won the draw. Hall's taking it from his own end. Pushes it across to Clifton. Boston's in transition. All alone! Up stars! What a finish! He looks so confident going in, there's no indecision. Whether it's shot or deep, he always seems to know what he wants to accomplish. Boston's effort pays off, and they take the one goal lead. You can't even really relax. I mean, it's so much time left in the game. You've got the lead. That's great. Now go and get another one. Pass broken up. Moves it quickly over to Nugent Hopkins. Turn that one aside. Moan's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Officials getting ready to drop the puck to get play back underway. Boston's got a hold of the puck. Can't make the connection on the pass. 
Tries to get it over to Krizlik. The Bruins are in transition. Here's a chance, and that goes wide. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Great A chance right in the middle of the ice, and the goaltender makes the stop. Oh, look at this. They are really starting to apply the pressure now. Takes the puck. And there's a hit with a little violence. And the defensive team's got it now. And it's picked up by the D. And they've got it in their own end here. And they'll skate it out of the zone. Boston's got the puck. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Marchand. Handles the puck. Over the net. Grabbed along the board by Marchand. The Oilers gain control of the puck against the wall. Tries to make that cross ice speed. And he gets sandwiched into the wall. That's really well played by the defensive player. He took away the angle, forced him into a spot, and then laid the hit. Boston's regained possession of the puck. Poked away at center by Marchand. Edmonton's got the puck against the half wall. And now it's grabbed by Oates. Fires it on net. Turned aside with a glove by Fuhr. Puck possession so critical in today's game, and the official ready to drop the puck right here. Good stop by Fuhr. There's the horn to conclude period number one, and Ray Ferraro's already off to grab his intermission hot dog. We'll be back in just a moment. And the opening face-off here in period number two is about set. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Well, Razor, you've had some time to digest that opening 20 minutes. How do you assess things? The Oilers are going to have to find a possession game that looks a lot different than that first period. They chased it around, and as a result, they're chasing the game. Moving into the attacking zone. Fear's gonna opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. We're still in the early stages of this period. It's 2-1. Edmonton's won the draw. Scooped up along the wall by Lowe. Nice zone entry from the left. Sends the feet in front. And that's stopped. Moan stopped the puck, and he's going to go for the whistle here. He hasn't had a lot to do this period, but he's been excellent and has been able to control the pace of play. Bergeron's won the draw inside his own end. Dished on over to Middleton. Long lead pass into the neutral zone. Stays with it. Tries to feed it over to Gretzky. Puck scooped up by Lowe. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Slides the puck across to Bork. The Oilers have it against the wall. Couldn't make the connection on the play. On the attack along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Lowe. The Oilers gain the zone. Taken by Lowe. Slides the puck over. Picked up along the boards by Dreisaitl. Quick pass to Kane. Sends the pass over. And he blocks a shot. Great defensive play. Gains the zone through the middle. Here's a short pass to Anderson. That's center ice now. He grabs the puck. 
The Bruins take possession in the defensive end. Puck moved over to Zaka. Shot off the mask. Kicked out that way. That's got to hurt. I don't care how much equipment you have or how good the mask is. That thing's coming 80-plus miles an hour. That's got to hurt. Nurse is moving the puck through his own zone. Boston's got a hold of it against the wall. Takes the feed at the point. Huddled away by Fuhrer. Slides it quickly to Yamamoto. Can't make it work. Toss it up in the neutral zone. Here's a chance. And he gets in front of that. Battle ensues for that loose puck along the boards. Moves it to Yamamoto. It's in a tie game. Past the midway mark of the frame. James and Ray with you tonight. We got a tie game. Takes a hit but still hangs on to the puck. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. And a puck check knocks the puck away. The Bruins gain possession in their own end. Makes a move, and the puck hops away from him. Wax it into the offensive zone. Boston's got the puck along the wall. Takes the pass. Boston's crossed the line and on the attack. Can't find his man. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. And they'll dump it in. The Bruins scoop it up along the boards. Take it along the wall by Nugent Hopkins. Looks to set up at the point now. And a solid save there as we play on. Strong fundamental save there. You make the save, you get it to the corner. That's puck control. Boston's got the puck along the boards. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Sends it to the middle. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Edmonton's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Some good stick work to force that turnover. And now he moves it quickly to Middleton. Boston's got the puck along the wall. Just misses! Oh man, he's frustrated with himself. He's got to get that on the net. Grabs the puck in the corner. Feeds the puck to Curry. The Oilers cross the blue line and are on the attack. Oh, he stops him with the glove. Great reflexes there. Late goings of this period. It's all tied up. The frozen biscuits dropped and we are back underway here. Boston's got it in their own zone. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Quick feed down low. And now he moves it to Bork. And he takes the dish. Here's a pass down low. Coffee's lugging the puck. And nearing the final minute of the second. The Oilers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Grabbed along the boards by Lowe. Passes it over to Coffee. They go on the attack through center. Boston's got a hold of the puck now. And there's the horn bringing the second period to an end. All right, they say three is the magic number. Period number three is coming up next. Time to drop the puck here in period number three. And we are underway here in the third. Still evened up. Will we see that go-ahead goal here? Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Don't mind the idea, but it doesn't work. Now you got to chase. Takes the feed. Here they come on the attack. Edmonton's gained possession along the boards. They go on the attack from the left side. Shot! Turns him away! And the goalie covers up for the whistle. 
James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. We are all tied up in this one. Boston's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Quick feed to Oates. Takes the feed. Nice pass. Here's a pass in front. Picked off in front. Gains the zone from the right side. And that's broken up. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Boston's through center and now in the offensive end. The Oilers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Into the offensive zone. Takes it and looks ahead. Moves it quickly over to Middleton. Puck grabbed by Lowe. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Quick pass to McAvoy. Down the right side and into the zone. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. He tries that extra move. I mean, sometimes it's okay. Sometimes you've got to just push the puck a little deeper. Now he's got a chance. Moves the puck along the half wall. Boston's got possession of the puck. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Keeps possession. Inside the offensive zone. Quick shot. Oh, tremendous stop on the play. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Dreisaitl's taking a nasty whack, and that's going to draw a penalty. Time for the officials to hand out the judgment. The Bruins are getting penalized for slashing. Gretzky's got a chance to use his zone ability to help the power play put one up on the board here, guys. Let's see how they do. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. And he makes the save on that play. There's another great save! Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. The Oilers gain possession along the wall. Picks it off in the offensive end. Puck picked up by Barry. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Shot! Denied by the puck stopper. Oh, nice use of the boards with the pink pass. Sends it in on the attack. The Oilers have it now. And now he tries to get it across to Dreisaitl. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Boston's PK unit gets their man out of the box. Really good pressure by the penalty killers there to keep this game tied. They tie up the power play in pretty nice style from here. position here now that they have the lead they can control how they want to run their lines onto the ice and try and bring this home Pasternak's gaining momentum he almost lost it for a second there but regains control of the puck and he takes the feed right through center and into the offensive zone here's a shot and makes the save the Bruins gain possession. Lindholm swinging the puck through center ice. Edmonton's looking to break out of their own end. Here's a short pass to Pugliarvi. Sends it into the offensive zone. The Bruins gain control of the puck against the wall. Handles it along the blue line. Slick feed. Looped up along the wall by Oates. Boston's got the puck against the boards. The Oilers take it along the wall. The Bruins gain control of it. And he regains control of the puck. Snapper from the spot. He scores! Could we get OT here? Well, we got a better chance now, don't we? The 
game's tied up late here in the third period. The coach was pushing his players to stay aggressive, and they get the equalizer. The Oilers get a hold of the puck off the draw. Sends it in deep. Boston's going to play the puck from behind the cage. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Picked up along the wall by Busick. The Bruins pick up steam and are on the attack. Takes a shot. Comes up with a stop. Fears on top of that one for a whistle. A little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. Here in the later stages of this period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Moves it to Neely. And it's a quick pass to Bork. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Takes the shot. Stops that one. Fuhrer's going to bounce on it and he'll take the whistle. He's usually a pretty conservative goaltender anyway. And so the opportunity to kill the play, he's going to take it. Teams are ready for the draw. The linesman about to drop the puck. Edmonton's got possession here in their own end. Receives the pass. Nearing the final 60 seconds in this one. Passes up ahead from the left wing. Feeds the puck over to O'Reilly. And they continue to apply pressure here. Nice feed. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. And that's stopped by the goaltender using his head this time. Now, by being in the right position, James, he gets so tight to the shooter, there's nowhere for the puck to go. Denies them in close. And that goes off the post and out. These two teams haven't spread out at all today. A tie game is almost broken as that shot hits the post. Oh, here we go. This team knows how to turn it up another gear, and they have done that here. And it's taken by the defense. And they'll skate it out of the zone. Now a quick pass to Curry. The Oilers carry it along the wall. And there's the buzzer. 60 minutes have been played, and we are still tied. Let's go to overtime, and we'll do that next here on EA Sports. For kids in need to see their heroes live, from our tickets for kids' luxury box. Thank you for your generosity. Will someone get a chance to put the game on their stick? Overtime looms. Time to find out if we get a winner here. Overtime. The puck is dropped. And that's knocked away by Pasternak. Edmonton's got the puck. And some good footwork to kick it away. The Bruins look to start the transition game. Here they come. Looking for space inside the D zone. And he slides it quickly to Bork. Nothing doing on that. Takes it to the net. And he puts that one aside with ease. The Bruins have it against the wall. Quick feed to Bork. On the attack into the offensive end right up the gut. And he slides it quickly to Marchand. Here he is, wrists it on the net. Scores! They take it in overtime. team out there tonight. Oh, what a play that leads up to that goal. That's like third eye superstar ability to make that pass to open up the play. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Zabalski. We'll see you next time we drop the puck.